Hello, let's play a bunch of daily word games. Today's bonus game is Orbits, so let's start with Orbit. Ooh, just a B on the left. Bees love to be first, so let's guess something like Blame. Yep, B is first. Do I keep guessing the word with B, or do I guess... How about this right word? I'd like to know what letter goes before that R. I thought of Frost, but there's no T. Um, Frock, is that spelled that way? Apparently it's accepted at least. Let's see. Is the left word beach like the tree? No. It's bench? Like the bench? Okay. So this is R-O. Um, ooh, it seems like there should be a lot of words left, but we've used a lot of the um used a lot of the letters. I'm thinking R-O-U or R-O-W. But without the N, I don't think we're ooh, yeah. I was gonna say we could be crowd as well. I was gonna say what I'm getting ahead of myself. Without the N, it's hard to be R. It's hard to be R O W. But there's also crowd. But there's no C. So I think we're okay with not using W. Could be double S, like gross. That's definitely possible. I think dross is a word as well. Um, or R O U, like um, group. Okay, so we've got a lot of options here. If I did. Um, gross, that helps with group. If I did group, it helps with gross. But if I do if I do gross, it'll tell me if it's dross or not. And if it's GRO, I'll just assume it's group. I think that's the best I'm going to do without doing a filler, and I don't really feel like doing a filler. It's GRO, so I'm going to say it's group. Yes, it was. Bench group. Nice. What's a group of benches called? I don't know. What's the collective term for benches? <laughs> All right, let's do Fibble. So each guess has a lie in it. So it starts us off with slope here. I'm going to, um, hmm. My instinct is to do the S, L, and E and just like do slime or something. So let's do that. Oh, okay. So it says not quite still lion, which means that the lie here is one of these greens was supposed to be gray because <laughs> there's no way one of the greens is yellow. Um, okay, well, these L's are lying. One of these L's is lying, meaning, meaning the S's and E's are definitely correct. Um, is there an S-L-I-E word? Slice, maybe? Ooh, okay. So one of these L's is lying. The L has definitely lied twice. <laughs> we don't know which ones. Um, but that means there is an I in the middle. Is there an S something I am E word? Or are we just S L I something E again? Slide? I think we're one of these. There we go. Okay. Wow, I got trapped. I basically had it right, but I just couldn't get that fourth letter right. All right, cool. Very quick solve today. Let's do between all. Start with lucky. Ooh, 12% from lucky. Okay, so I think I'm going to try house. Okay, a little bit before house. I'm thinking H-A, like happy? Ooh, okay, so if we're H-A, it would have to be a really late H-A. I'm thinking maybe we're H-E. I could try, like, hello, I guess. <laughs> Why not? All right, I think we are H-E then. Um, just a really early H-E. What would that be? Heady? Close. Could it be H-E-A still? I think Heath is a word. Oh, Heath is the word. Okay. You know, I'd actually thought of Heath earlier in my head, and I was like, I don't even know if that's a word, so I'm not going to say it. <laughs> I should have. <laughs> I should have tried it. <laughs> what, do, what does Heath mean? I can't remember. It just in my head, it's a word, but I don't actually know how to use it in a sentence or what it means. Interesting. Um, all right. Well, I'm going to move on. I am low on time where I would look it up, but we're going to start Word 500 with Heath. Double letter. Wonderful. And I've gotten this question a couple times recently. Notice this this red, angry face. There's three difficulties for Road 500, and each difficulty has a different answer. The difficulty affects what can be the answer. So for example, in the green standard, you can't have repeat letters, and you can't have J, Q, X, or Z. I don't like that. I think anything should be anything goes is good. So that's the, that's the mode I play, but it, it means that if you just load up Word 500 and start playing, uh, it's going to default you to the green face difficulty uh, with those with the limited answer list. 
and you're going to get a different answer than me. It doesn't mean yours is easier than mine. It just means that you don't have to worry about double letters. You don't have to worry about those specific J, Q letters. Anyway, Heath got nothing, which is actually kind of a good result. Um, so let's get some really good letters out of this. How about Spunk? <laughs> I don't know why. One green and spunk. Okay. Uh, I don't know what letter to use. Usually I'd use the vowel, but U is the least common vowel. Let's start with a S if we can. How about just like S L? What are we doing? S L O or S L I? Slimy. What? What? Okay. Slimy. I guess slime and fibble too. That's pretty funny. All right. Sure. So I was primed for it. All right, let's do polygonal. Experts on. We have a seven letter word. The, these two letters repeat, these two letters repeat. So if we did ing, we get both of the repeats. This is a little bit hard to fill out though. Let me be. You can't do in, right? You can't do another n there. Um, yeah, I'm not sure I like this. Okay, so we'll, we'll, we'll come up with something else. So if I do something like er, then I get that r repeated. Then what would go here? Ooh, you know what I want to try? I want to try like ERS. Let's see if that works. Um, it doesn't immediately seem bad, but I also like, unless like Easter's is a word. Easter's is a word. Okay. So, okay. So this is nice. We Both E's are yellow, meaning that there is a repeated E, but it's not in this slot. So it has to be repeated here. And then we, we have an R and an A somewhere. We could do EA. R, that would give us the repeated letter. I don't know what goes between this R and E though, so I don't think I like that. We could repeat the A, um, like R, R lame. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think that's really a word. Um, this could be this could be the repeated R, and we could have the A. No, we can't really have the A elsewhere, can we? And then again, I have the same problem that I because I just did the same thing. Okay, so what are we doing here? Maybe EA is still true. Is there another place to put the R? Like here. Okay, I like this actually. So like, hmm. How do we end this though? Good question. Like E-A-C-H-E? -E? Or like Cree? It feels like there should be something here, but I'm not seeing it. All right, I, I feel like I'm close, but I also feel like I have to do a filler. Um, see, we know that's E. I'm gonna give us another shot. The R doesn't go here. I like the R here. And then the A, maybe, could the A be here? R. I had this fulfilled before. I didn't give it a whole lot of thought, though. Just because it doesn't feel like we can do it. Yeah, I don't like it. All right, so what, what would I want to do? I think for a filler, I want to put R second to see if it's there. And then... We know that's E, so I don't need to put an E there. Let, let's just get all new letters besides that R if I can. Um, not, not exactly easy just to come up with a seven letter word, but this letter here in both spots is, is basically just fished for a yellow because we know it's E. What if I guess something like creamer? I know it seems weird. No, see, I don't need the E. <laughs> um, crim crimper? I'm going to go with crimper. It'll tell us if the R is repeated. The R is not repeated, and we don't have any of those other letters. Ugh. Okay, so we know this is E, and we know this is not R, but I already kind of figured it wasn't. But R is not second, which is also good to know. So we're limited in where we can put R. R is here. Actually, R is only here, because we know it's not repeated, so it's not in this slot, and it's yellow here, and it's yellow there. So we found where the R goes, Then we need an A. Could this be the A? I feel like it has to be. This is a tough word. Like A D E? Gatorade. Um <laughs> Allerade. Or Rail Rail. Is, is any of this gonna make sense? Anor Anorade. Rain Rail Raid Rage. Anna Rage? I don't know. I think I think I need to do another filler. Um, can I do like ghoul? Gould. I don't know. Is that a word? Ghouler? Ghouls? No. 
Darn. I just want I want to get some just some letters. I just need to I need to narrow it down if anything. Boulder. Sure. None of those letters. Okay, let's look at this again. Now that I can scan the keyboard with fewer letters. We know the E is here. We know the R is here. And then the A is if the A wasn't the repeat, it would have to go before an E, which I don't like. So we got rid of the D. That's nice. I was thinking A D E. I was thinking A L E. It's not A B E. Maybe A V E. Anna Rave. What is this? Okay. What if I what if I try the G and the V, right? And the N maybe like I don't know. Graven Gravens. Darn. Graven is a word, but it, it, you can't do short words. Um. Gr gravier. I know. I know these are lame words. Um. Darn it. Can't even do that. Um. I don't know. Maybe I should just try to figure out this word again. This has been a weird word. We know the A doesn't go here. So the only other option is the A to go there. And that just seems weird, ending in AE. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna think it ends in AE until I can prove it. It's not this. I need to know if there's an N in the word, a V in the word, a G in the word. I really just need a, a word with G, V, and N. Um, I could, I could just end in ING and get, <clears throat> Half of what I need. Is there like a V word? Um, literally can do anything there. Craving. <clears throat> There's a V and a G. So A's are here. E's are here. R is here. It's average. Oh, okay. <clears throat> that took me so long to figure out. <laughs> Let's move on. How many words were there? There weren't very many words. Avocado. Crazy. All right. Well, well, there's only 14 words. I'm actually pretty happy when I come up with anything. Although Easter's was was an uncommon one, so I didn't come up with one of the ordinary possible answers. And some of these may not ever actually be answers, like trestle. I don't know sure if that would be an answer. Lanolin. Let's do the mini. Um, what do we do with the middle two being the same? Um, livid. Ooh, V's in the middle. That's kind of nice. Maybe it's like bevel. It's not. Interesting. I thought for sure it would be something like that. Uh, like, is this an A or, or an O or a U? Navel. Oh, hit B instead of N. Good thing Babel's not a word. All right, cool. Well, let's move on. Let's do symbol. Start with blaze. A, E in place seems reasonable. We'll try that first. Um, how about snare? Okay, AE in places is reinforced, although it could still be the EA swapped, but we're going to try AE again. Um, what do we want to do? Um, I got rid of a lot of good letters with that last guess. Um, how about phage? Still reinforcing AE there. What could it be? I'm trying to think about what goes first. Like, what are the first two letters? Could it be? Oh, there's no G, or I would say, actually, gay. Just e. is there? Is there like a a U A E word? Suave, but there's no S. I'm not sure there's anything else. A lot of the, a lot of the words I'm thinking of are A U. Well, like I A E. Seems tough. O A E. Mm, doesn't look good, does it? What if we start with, yeah, like image? If we start with like an I or just any vowel, what's left though? We could also start with an A or an E if we want to. Um, like evade. Hmm. Still just the AE. That's crazy. What's left? We could start with another A. Um, I don't want to run out of guesses here, but we're, we're okay so far. Can't be adage. I'm wondering for A-T-E. The T being left really stands out to me. I'd like to get rid of that. Or, or K-E. The problem is, what do we start with? I can also... It could also still be E-A. Is there a word for that? That might be easier. I just don't think it's easier. <laughs> it's kind of a weird formation. It's tempting to do a filler, but I don't usually do fillers in symbol. Sometimes I will. How about quake? Okay, it is A-K-E. We don't have another E. We could have another A. Awake. 
there we go. That I was very trappy. <laughs> really hard to think of words at some point. All right, cool. At least I got it. Got an awaken six. I think that's that's okay. All right, let's do fusel. And for fusel, similar to Word five hundred, I play the blind version, which has a different answer than the regular version. I used to play both, but I cut out the regular. I just do the blind. So in our first guess, I have to repeat a letter. So I can't do. Oh, I can do awake. So let's do it. All right, so we end in E. Now this guess, we're not going to get any info about these two slots. So let's put the good letters first, like, I don't know, ST. You know, I'm just going to guess, uh, let's, I was going to say snake, but there's no A, so let's not do that. Um, ST? Or like TR maybe? How about tripe? It doesn't really matter what else we put. All right, so we know there's no TR. That's about as good as we can get out of that, um, unless we had done a filler. Um, how about just something like chime? All right, so we know there's an M in the word. The problem is this twist, which I didn't tell you. This twist, see how the green and yellow, they're ambiguous. It won't tell us whether it's green or yellow. It just tells us, hey, that's in the word. Now this twist, in every single one of these slots that are dotted, I have to put a vowel. Y does count as a vowel, but it, it means that I'm not going to be going for the answer here. So um, I think I need to try for an OU here. What would I put here? I don't know. It's hard to put three vowels like that. Um, all right, I think I, I think I can't limit myself like that because I can't think of words. I just I, I need even just to throw away here just to get to get through this guess. What do we start with? Like a? I could I could try a m. I don't know if I can. Un maybe un un is pretty good, but then I uh, two vowels. Two vowels seems tough with un, doesn't it? Why can't I think of a word? How about ideal? It's not ideal, but at least it gets me. <laughs> yeah, I got I got nothing. I'm not surprised. Okay, this next twist, we get a lie. So one of the letters lies. I'm going to assume we end in M-E still. Because, um, I, I mean, the M, that's a pretty decent place for the M, considering we end in E. Um, I really didn't learn much from that last guess. What should I guess, though? I need to think of a word that ends in M-E. Maybe, maybe uh, O-M-E? I can't really think of a word though now. I mean, ME looks good until I try to fill in a word with what we have left. What's another option? What about like SM? SMO, I guess. Smoke is a word, but there's no K. I kind of don't mind guessing smoke because we're going to get a lie and I can really hope that the K ends up lying. All right, I am going to do that. It's a quasi filler. Uh, is there nothing, really nothing else I can guess there? I'm going to do smoke. Whoa, okay. So we know the K is the lie. Perfect. So this is an E, and then there's an SMO, but they're all out of place. Weird. Um, how do we do that? Oh, and then this last get. Oh, this is a terrible one to have second to last, which is I have to guess a word with all the vowels removed. So I can't go for the answer. But let me, let's think about what the answer is, though. We know E's at the end. We know this SMO aren't lying, because the K has to be lying. Because this K can't be lying. That that twist doesn't lie. Only this twist lies. So I don't I don't think we're ending in O E, are we? Like how how are we rearranging this? Maybe we start with M O and then we have like an S somewhere. Moose. I think our answer is moose. So I think I want to think of a word that I can test the M and S there. Um. Oh, it could be mouse as well. And I'm not going to be able to test moose versus mouse because I can't guess any vowels in this guess. Oh no. So it's going to be a 50-50, even if I confirm this MS. Moose or mouse? Darn it. Yeah, there's, no, there's literally no way for me to, to tell. Um, I, I don't even know if I want to do that. I, I don't even care. It's moose or mouse. Um, let's go with mouse. All right, phew, it was mouse. Okay. All right, we are finishing with orbits here. So we are playing in the prototype mode. Um, basically, here it, in the normal mode, it'll tell you as you guess them whether you got it right. Here, we, we just have to figure out the order and then try to lock it in. So <clears throat> are there any obvious ones like setup? I don't know if that's cover up also would work. Up is not a good one to use right away just because of. Um, 
a lot of things can be something up or up something. Uh, thin air makes a lot of sense to me. Paper thin. So what if we do paper thin, thin air? Air what? I don't, actually, I don't know if, what what would you what would do we even put after air? Uh, air it can't be air thin or air paper. Air set, air up, air fire, air cover, air wall. The only thing I can think of is air cover, like air cover, like in war, like in battles. And then cover up, upset, wallpaper, maybe set fire. Let's see if this is right. Hey, that was right. Okay. So we got paper thin, thin air, air cover, cover up, upset, set fire, firewall, and wallpaper. Nice. And those are the games for today. Hope you enjoyed them. If you did, then why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below. Thank you.